When the universe was nothing but a void of darkness, specks of magic formed from nothingness, forming primordial gods from a new element, ether, which is pure magic at its core, it created the first bits of life in this new universe, known as Aetherians in the present time. As the Aetherians learned of this fresh new universe, they created what is known as the Creationist Era. The Aetherians created everything you can possibly think of, anything you can think of, as well as the main building blocks such as fire, air, earth, nature, and water, as well as more magical components to the cauldron that was this fresh universe. Death, light, and darkness. Eight Aetherians aspired to rule over these elements as stewards of the primordial magic that created them. All are taking forms correlating with what element they chose to rule over. These gods are now known as Infernon, Umi, Quaro the Stone Father, Huracanos, Voidadreus, Gabriels the Overseer, Thanatos, and Gaia. The Aetherians, who did not choose a specific element, took over as the rulers of the Aether element in the birthplace of the universe, Aetherius, with the help of the Adrius tree, a mythical tree that grows within Aetherius. The tree is of primordial ether origin. It grew from the roots of the goddess Gaia and is similar to Yggdrasil in Norse mythology. The Adrius tree links all magic and worlds together like glue. These Aetherians created worlds beyond beauty, from seas of mythical waters to mountains of enchanted stone. The Aetherians have created a mythical and magical world. That's things change lore for you, Nerevar. Why am I talking about a random project some girl is making in her room? I don't know, it sounded cool, don't judge me.